of the land borders let's go to Apalau where Ghanaian officials are in talks with their Togolese counterpart over the reopening of their side of the border the Keto South Municipal Chief Executive Maxwell Lugudo tells TV3 discussions to have both ends opened for trade and commerce to begin in earnest are in the offing the closure of the border had been a, a concern to many residents, not only in Ketu South, but also those around Angloga, parts of the Volta region, extending to the regional capital, Ho. But it's also those in the capital of the country, Accra, Kumasi and beyond, who needed this border post reopened. And so the president's announcement that the reopening would take full effect had come as a relief to many Ghanaians. But experiences of the last 12 hours had given indication to those who had attempted to cross to Togo or from the other side into Ghana that because the Togolese counterpart or officials have decided not to reopen their border, it's resulted in instances where there have been some disagreement of not enabling mass citizens either from both countries we're talking about ghana or the republic of togo to either exit or make entry uh, when it is open it means we uh, goods services and persons can uh, exit or enter the country half uh, they have to go through the uh, the vaccination yes because it's one of the, the main requirements that uh, the, uh, yesterday the president mentioned, which uh, all of us high heard it. So I believe the health officials are there. You know, the facilitation chain, you have the various institutions and each institution and its mandate. So the health officials has to clear the, the traveler after he has met the health conditions and then before the, the traveler comes to immigration. But it looks like officials of the municipal assembly as well as traditional rulers seem to be extending some form of appeal to the government of the republic of ghana led by the president nanado Danko kufado to have extensive consultations with his counterpart in the republic of togo to at least ensure that a decision taken by ghana could also be replicated by his counterpart in togo but unfortunately the togolese counterpart uh, they haven't opened the border yet uh, i had information from various quarters i don't know how true it is that uh, his excellency the president of the republic of togo might be uh, addressing the togolese uh, nation today or tomorrow which we are hoping if all things being equal the other side to be open for everybody to freely go and come Every everyone who is a trap, everyone to put is allowed to, to go. You see the point? Yes. But the fact of the matter is that uh, because the Togo side is not open, and now they have to satisfy those traveling conditions go to the continent. That's why the the place is very quiet. Those you you see crossing are the local uh, people who live around the border who just move their camp. Uh, Let's shift our attention.